In order for the pump to display the proper output in gallons per hour, liters per hour, or gallons per day, it is necessary to calibrate the flow of the pump. In order to do that, press no until settings is displayed. And then press yes. Press no to move through the settings screens until calibrate flow is displayed. And then press yes. In order to calibrate the pump, it is necessary for the pump to be installed under its normal operating conditions, including suction conditions and discharge pressure conditions. You will also need a calibration cylinder in order to measure how much the pump pumps during the calibration process. The pump will first ask us what the stroke length knob is set to. That is this large knob here in the center of the control panel. If the stroke knob is changed any time after the calibration is performed, a calibration will have to be done again. Once the stroke knob setting is entered, press the Yes key. The pump will then ask us if we're ready to run the calibration. Pressing Yes will tell us to press Yes to start the pump. The pump will now run until we stop it. It is recommended that at least a 30 second drawdown time is taken for calibration to be done. Once 30 seconds has passed, press the Yes key to stop the pump, and then enter the amount of milliliters the pump pumped out of the calibration cylinder. This can be done with the up and down arrow keys. Once the volume has been entered, press Yes, and the pump will then be calibrated.